Hello, I'm Tito Matos, and I'm going to give you a quick workshop on La Plena from Puerto Rico. For Plena, we use this handheld drum called Panderetas, and each one of them has a last name depending on the role that it, it, it does on the music. So this one, which is the one that is uh, tuned with the low pitch, is called Pandereta Seguidor, S-E-G-U-I-D-O-R. And it plays in four by four like this. Your thumb goes to the, near to the rim, play the, the bottom part, and then the slap on the center. It has a constant pattern that never change. You can do some decoration if you want like this. But the main thing is this. And that's the traditional way of playing the pandereta seguidor. Of course, there's nowadays a more contemporary way, which is the whole hand, using the whole hand, and not using, um, not using the fingers as much. And it goes like this. As in the other pattern, the bottom part is the most important part, tone and slap. And that's pandereta seguidor. Then we add the second drum, which is called pandereta punteador. P-U-N-T-E-A-D-O-R. And it has to be tuned a little bit higher, like mid-range. And I'm going to teach you both the traditional way and the contemporary way. First of all, the traditional way, it goes like this. Your right hand is basically keeping the tempo and then my left is doing a seguidor this drum is also keeping the same pattern constant one two three four five uh, the contemporary way of playing this pandereta punteador will be something like this, also constant. Two tones, one slap. If you are coming into a plena song, the best way is to pl uh, play it the first hit, just give a silence and then start on the second count. So it will be one, two, three, four, one. And in that way, you're always going to be playing on the beat. One, two, three, four. Then we are going to add requinto. Requinto is the high pitch drum. And in this case, this drum is not uh, keeping a constant pattern. This one is improvising most of the time. So the traditional way of playing will be something like that. And then the contemporary way, again, you uh, stop using the fingers as much. It's basically the whole hand. And it will be also improvising over the basic pattern that these two drums are laying, you know, you know that these two drums are putting to lay the foundation. So it goes like this.
And then I'm going to introduce to you the instrument that keeps all the three panderetas together. This one is called el guicharo, and it's in charge not only of keeping the tempo, but also tightening up the whole pattern of la plena. It goes like this. This is going to tie up the drums, which are supposed to be sounding like this. And this is La Plena. <laughs> 